What is up, everybody? This is Anthony with VR365, and I am in Derail Valley. Yes, I said I'm going to play the demo, and I'm playing the demo. This is Demo Veld number five, Alpha. Have fun, and feel free to drop by Steam Community Forums and tell us if you like it. Yeah, so this is Derail Valley. This game is going to come out, I think, on, um, well, next week. It's coming out next week, right? Uh, let's see here. Controls. Now, you can see it's showing an outline of a Vive controller, even though I don't have a Vive controller. So this is obviously a little bit Vive-centric. And sometimes when that happens, you might have some control issues. So that's a slight concern. Alrighty, so here I am. I am side. I am inside the engine. I am inside the locomotive. And you know, I gotta tell you that right now I love this. This looks good. This looks very good. These bushes look good. These grass looks good. The mountains look good. And I feel kind of a sense of space. I feel like I'm inside this cockpit here oh that's cool listen to that you know I got a really nice loud horn um, I'm liking the feel here I although one thing I will admit this feels too goddamn big like this is a huge cabin thing for the engine of a locomotive I don't know it seems really wide to me but maybe I'm tripping okay so I have no idea what to do here um, I'm just going to, oh, there we go. We are now moving. So I have no freaking clue what I'm doing here, but we are starting to move. Um, it's a little bit of a bumpy ride here. This is called Derail Valley, by the way. I don't know, like, what's, what's the object of the game? Like, do you get more points for derailing in the right way? I don't know what to tell you here. Um, but yeah, graphically, this is pretty darn impressive. It's very very loud oh I just stopped okay uh, derailed huh apparently we derailed press to restart okay let's try that again let's, I'm gonna check some of these other modes okay so we got the room scale mode seated mode room scale yeah I'm gonna do room scale I'm standing up I don't have my chair here that's one of the issues that we do deal with with VR games is like, honestly, before I was starting this demo, I thought to myself, should I go get myself a chair? Should I really be in a chair for this? Or is this like a stand up kind of a deal? And I guess it has both options. So we're going to try restarting real quick. All right, we have this instrumentation panel in front of us. I don't know if we can turn these levers. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like we can hit any of these buttons. Now, this lever does seem to do something. What about this? I just turned that that way. Have no freaking idea. Let's try moving this. Oh, I'm going backwards now. Oh, shit. That's probably... I didn't derail, though, huh? All right, didn't derail. So let's try moving it in the other direction. No. Okay, I guess that's only to go backwards. Okay, let's go forwards. Oh no, that's our horn. That's our horn. Okay, um, let me try moving this again. Let's see. Reverser. Oh, I see. I put it in reverse there. Okay, so now we're going forward. So, how do I slow down though? Train brake. Oh, here's a brake. Yeah, I'm going to try to slow down. Doesn't seem to be doing much of anything. Let's see what this does. Pushing buttons, uncoupling, coupling. Have no idea what we're doing here. Um, pushing buttons, pushing buttons. Honking horn. Got a nice water bottle. But you know what? It looks pretty cool. I just don't know. I don't know what this game is all about. Like, what is the point of this game? I understand it's Derail Valley. Um, it's kind of cool. Just the experience of being inside this train is kind of enjoyable. It, it has a realistic vibe to it being inside here. 
just the way the the scenery is moving at a realistic clip the bounciness is not causing me any real problems and uh, the scenery looks pretty good i'm getting an occasional hitchiness in my headset every now and then this time i'm going a lot farther than i did that first time and we're just exploring the countryside you know and it looks pretty darn good i'll tell you what this has better graphics than rolling line if i'm talking pure graphics rolling line is a different kind of a game though but the graphics on this thing are impressive absolutely let's see we do have a quick guide here i can open this up as set reverser to forward position release brake uh, gently push the throttle forward release throttle release throttle to stop accelerating okay let's see if we can stop accelerating All right, we've slowed down considerably. We're going over this bridge here. This river below looks pretty good. And here we have come to a complete stop. We are at a complete stop. Uh, the scenery is very attractive. Let's go ahead and move forward now. Oh wait, is that the wrong way here? Let's see here. Maybe we got a release brake. Okay, now we're going backwards. Okay, we don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. I'm going to let us slow down here. We're not trying to go backwards. Okay, stop, bro. Oh, man, I'm going even faster backwards. Okay, maybe we need the brake. Let's, let's grind those brakes. Grind those brakes. They're grinding, they're grinding, but you know what? They're doing a damn good job of it, don't you think? Okay, so I don't know if that's in the right spot here. Let's see. Here we go. Now we're headed back forward. So, yeah, I can honk my horn. I've got a beautiful-looking world. How cool would a derail... Oh, I was just going to say, how cool would a derail be right here? into the freaking river and stuff. And that's kind of exactly what happened. So I had a derail right when I thought I was gonna have a derail. That actually worked out really nicely. That is really cool. All right, well, this is a quick little brief look at the demo for Derail Valley, which is uh, by developer Alt Future. It is coming out this week. It is going to be arriving very soon. I think it comes out on Friday of this week. So uh, certainly an interesting game. I, I still kind of don't get it exactly, but it is a cool world to check out. All right, I will see you guys next time. Take it easy. Later.